Hi, I'm Catherine and I'm from Gateway Family Services. Uh, we're a community interest company. Uh, we began in 2006 um, and our objective is to run services that promote health and well-being. Uh, and also what we do is we find and train and develop and employ people to run those services. Um, since we began we've worked with more than 10,000 people and we've employed more than 200 people either as support staff or apprentices. Um, the, the service that I'd like to speak about today is something called um, cardio rehab, we, we call it Strictly Rehab, um, and it's a project that works with uh, patients who've just left hospital following um, a heart operation or people who have had or are at risk of having a heart attack. And what happens is they're invited along to some gentle exercise sessions, in this case it's dancing, um, and what we've also done is we've found and trained a team of volunteers who run the service. So in terms of saving money and saving time, we feel this service is a really good example because it runs very cost effectively. Mm -hmm. the, uh, the clients, the patients get the rehabilitation they need and also the volunteers get some really valuable work experience. Um, so what you're going to do now is you're going to see a clip which is from Kate G, who's um, one of the members of staff we've been working with at University Hospital Birmingham and she's a nurse consultant. With the volunteer programme, the one thing that it has done is, as I say, to build bridges between the community, the hospital and our patients and their partners. The volunteers are starting to really get to know these patients and although it's early days, a phone call every now and then to say, how are you doing, helping them with possibly the shopping or just, just being there and knowing the patient knowing they're there is making a difference. How much of a difference is too early to tell, but I'm sure it's positively contributing to the patient's recovery. And presumably the volunteers, they wouldn't really be people that could come from any other no. pocket of funding. Could you no. tell me a little bit about I that? I think the thing with the volunteers is it's, it's a bit of a toe-dipping exercise for them. Not all of them, in fact none of them that I'm aware of have ever had experience in the health service before or worked with people who have been unwell. And I think for them they're beginning to realise what health means and all of them have been have trained in cardiac resuscitation they all know a little bit more about healthy eating what exercise is all about so maybe as well they're becoming healthier as being part of the gateway volunteer befriend service Thanks. Uh, we provide a range of services as i've said another one is health trainers uh, this is a service that we're commissioned to provide by the pct um, what happens is we, we have clients refer to us who need to either stop smoking, um, lose weight, reduce their drinking. It's all about lifestyle change and what happens is one of our health trainers works with them to help them make that change. You're now going to see a clip from one of our clients who's called Simon. He was referred into the service by his GP because he needed to lose weight to be able to have an operation. What Simon doesn't mention in the clip is that actually he has now had that operation. Mm -hmm. Can you just tell us how, why, why you feel like you got benefit from the health trainer service? Well, you just give me that step by getting the first three months for free at the Slim World. And um, I think with those first three months, because I've done quite well in my first three months, I think I lost, stolen half or more, I think it was about that. And it's given me that urge to just keep it going and carry on with it. And um, I've been out of work as well, partly with with my health. And um, yeah, I think it's really helped me out a lot. And it's just determination to keep it going. And uh, as well as that, I'll come down and have my meetings with yourself. And yeah, it's always there, like trying to get the extra pounds off for the next coming see you as well. Do you <laughs> know what I mean? So we must even build up to it. I've lost 36 and a half pounds up. So today's day, I've joined through the Slim World through the um, health trainer service, and um, she's lost exactly the same amount as weight as all I have, and um, so also I'll give um, a bit of, you know, a spur with the rest of the family because my son's lost over a stone and a half as well now, and my daughter she's lost a few pounds really because she doesn't need to lose a lot, but yeah, we all eat healthier as a um, you know result of. You know, losing weight really is sort of like more of a change of lifestyle.